So this is where you're gonna see me in videos pretty much all week, if I'm in videos at all, because I am so busy and I'm trying to get everything done before our trip this weekend, which I cannot wait. I'm counting down the days. I started off with two orders this week because I knew that we were going out of town. And then somebody contacted me last week wanting me to make a small cake. And I said yes, I would squeeze her in. And then she proceeded to one, make her small cake larger, two, add 15 cookies to it, and three, add a smash cake to it. So I have not been very happy. Like this is probably the most difficult customer I've ever had to deal with in the last three years. And every time I tell her to stop, you know, to ask her, actually I'm not telling her, but to ask her to stop making changes, she makes another change. And I'm like, we have to finalize your order today. And if I would have known this order was gonna be so big, I would not have done it knowing that I have two other orders and knowing that we're going out of town on Friday. So that has been very frustrating. So I think you guys saw the cookies I made yesterday for her. And actually it's, oh, hold on, I'll show you the cookies just in case you didn't see. So here are the cookies. She wanted her son's name on them and then a one and then different color balloons on them. And one of the many changes that she tried to make was the invitation for her son's party had a one on it and then it had her son's face, like a picture, like an actual photo of her son inside the one and she asked me if I could do that to her cookies to make it look like the invitation and I just told her I was like I can't do that with cookie icing it's just it would look awful you wouldn't know what it would even what it was and I said let's just keep it the way it was what you originally told me and then she tried to change it to something else and I finally convinced her to keep it the way it was because it's I just think this idea was much cuter than what she was trying to come up with so, and then I made those cookies and had extra cookie dough and decided to make a couple of Mother's Day sets and I sold those today. I posted them on my Facebook page and they sold within like 10 minutes. So I'll show you what those look like as well. It's just a trophy with the number one with a couple of tulips and mom and it comes in like a cute little metal container. So I spent all day yesterday making cookies and then today I've been working on a cake which I just completed not too long ago and I wanted to show it to you guys because I think it turned out really cool. And then I have another cake I need to complete today to stay on track and then two cakes to work on tomorrow. And then of course both boys have practice tonight. So this is going to be difficult. It's going to be those nights that I'll be up really late. But I finished this cake today which I think is super cute. Obviously Chewbacca and Darth Vader. So I've made a Darth Vader face before and it did not look very good. And so the second time I've made one, which is this one, it turned out much better. What are y'all doing there? <laughs> Just kidding. That's so stupid. I can't believe I did that. Goodness gracious. Let me start over. What's up guys and gals? I'm on my way to go pick up Jacob from school. I just got off work, switched vehicles real quick, grabbed Amy's, and now we're going to uh, we. Why am I saying? Well, I guess it is we. It's you guys in my hand and uh, myself. We're driving to pick up Jacob, and then we have two practices. We have Xander's practice and Jacob's practice, so there's going to be a lot of practice footage tonight. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, because I know a lot of y'all enjoy watching the baseball stuff. We try to capture as many moments as we can because you never know. They might just end up not playing baseball anymore at some point and they'll have these to look back on and, and see that we really pushed them to try to be their best, which is what we try to do. So let's go pick him up now. We're gonna get some pizza in our bellies too because that's just what we're gonna eat today. I'm sorry you guys are not gonna get any of that, but if you call up your local pizza joint, you can get your own pizza and enjoy that just like we're gonna enjoy ours. <laughs> Sounds like you're farting when you're doing that, dude. It tinkles. We're on our way to two practices tonight. Yay. Ew, stop now. farting. So what kind of test did you have today, Xander? A DCC. What is that? Um, it's marbles. A district checkpoint. <laughs> Can you stop farting? And what did you make on it? 100. Oh my goodness, how did you do that? I got seven camp tickets. And at the end of the year, um, you have to have 50 go off five days. So but they're they're collecting camp tickets in class. What well, I want to say. Okay, well you gotta explain to so, them what it I is. Know. Okay. They are having like a fun event at the end of the school year. It's the last full week of school. The last week of school, and they have to collect camp tickets 
for the last nine weeks of school and that they to be able to participate they had to get 50 and to do all out all access which I, don't, I guess there's several different activities and you have to get 75 and he has like a couple more weeks to collect tickets and how many do you have already. 85 camp tickets that's awesome so you'll get to have lots of fun so for the kid can you stop farting okay. so for the kids that uh, don't get 75 where do they go to Camp works a lot. Camp works a lot. That sounds that like lots of fun. That does not sound like fun. <laughs> it's like camp learns a lot. Right. Good job, dude. I'm super proud of you. Playing four corners. Ethan, when do you get back to first? Oh, you? so close. Mm, it's a little high. Hard, hard, hard. Chop, chop, chop. Great job. 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 So Eric is having to relearn how to use the pitching machine because he has to do it in the game tomorrow. Hopefully he pitches our kids some good good strikes for them to hit. Our turn balls. No, that's not good. Why? Then our kids can't hit them. Why are you so close? <laughs> and for the other team, but he's pitching for our team, dude. What? That's not fair. I hit my knee. I, was, I, was, I like go out of the seat. <laughs> this is more entertaining to video you than your brother at the moment. <laughs> I hit my knee. <sighs> you saw a teeny tiny spider and break like, out. I doubt it. And then I go like I go backwards. <laughs> I wish I would have like, seen this. I go like that, and I hit my knee on the table. <laughs> I thought we had less, less Is this spider on me? Yes, it's on your back. Mom. Yes, it's on your back. Well, I got you. I got you, Mom. You look over there. Yes. 
Eric's pitching to Zainer. Hey, don't wrap that bat so much when it's coming around. Remember? You want to put it on your shoulder, put it up. Greg, move to the ball faster. <laughs> I almost knocked him over. Did you see his brother throwing at him? We'll catch those. One more. His brother doesn't do it in a nice way. Yeah. It's not meant to be nice. <laughs> Nice stop, Carter. Wide stance, Jacob. He just told you about it. Get wide. Lefty first base, and he's a pretty big kick. So he's gonna, chances are, he's gonna place him on that team. Right. Woo. I have a kid that bought a one you made. Where's the one you made? Where's that black? I don't bring. Go one. You can put the loops in. I'm not usually messed up, but I'm like, you know, he's talked about it for a long ride. What's she looking for? Little cups. You gotta help him in the long run. Get there, get there. Who will I help? No. <laughs> <laughs> They got old men that sound like a lot of it's a lot of it. But it's like a Yeah, right. The big shirt. I bought one. I bought one. I Yeah, I'm good on that. You don't have to eat in and out. That's good. Super good. 